rest of the summer while he concentrated on his bunt instead. But meanwhile, Leonard visited his grandparents in exotic Borough Park, Brooklyn. He developed a crush on the neighbor's ravishing daughter, Rivka, finally gathering courage to introduce himself. And as he approached, she pulled a pair of iPod buds from her ears. Hey, kid, you know what I hate? She said. I, no. I hate musicians named Leonard. Leonard Cohen, Leonard Bernstein, hell, Leonard, they all suck. <laughs> Okay, yeah, well, my name is Leonard Mumble, about to introduce himself as Fernando. When his mother, his grandmother opened the, the, the house window and said, Leonard, Leonard, Leonard Bubalajivkala, Leonard, come help will be like the candles, Leonard. <laughs> Leonard's kind of slept snugly that summer, while Fibby, the self-described Romeo among us, working, worked as a lifeguard in Chicago. He shared a chair with fraternal twins, Teresa and Terrence, who looked like they'd been, they'd been suckled on Baywatch juice. <laughs> Tall, blind, pneumatic in all the right places, Fibby quickly developed a minor obsession until the moment finally arrived. He was lying in the sand with Teresa on the deserted beach at sunset when she asked if he had a kind. Of course he did, but our resident ladies man wouldn't use it with a lady. He'd been lying to himself. Teresa was the wrong twin. Fibby was in secret lunch with Terrence. <laughs> we didn't call him Fibby for nothing. In the end,